But uh, uh, how can you give today a document of 224 pages? You expect the members to read them yesterday and then to internalize it and make a voting today. They bring it in the night and then they bring it to vote at night. How? Even the members themselves, majority of them were voting. They didn't know what they were voting exactly for. And that is why the people that should be blamed is not the... the and, and, and. Yeah. I know in Kenya you are sleeping. Ukuni mchana kabisa. We are here at Rabat. Uh, this is the town of Rabat in Morocco. Number one. Uh, I want to talk about the issue of the voting. And I know Kenyans want to know who voted and who did not vote. Number one thing that uh, I have not been in Kenya is that we were we had this trip in a revolution last year that it was planned like three months ago. And because of three months ago, uh, we had uh, there was we did not know uh, that when is going the bill is going to be discussed. And majority of the members of the parliament were in the house in the, uh, knew that the bill will come next week. And again, even uh, Ojeda Molo said that uh, uh, how can you give today a document of 224 pages? You expect the members to read them yesterday and then to internalize it and make a voting today. They bring it in the night and then they bring it to vote at night. How? Even the members themselves, majority of them were voting. They didn't know what they were voting exactly for. And that is why the people that should be blamed is not the... the and, I, and I want also to blame our minority leader. You, when I just saw you online saying that uh, you had agreed anonymously to vote today when you knew that most of the members had gone outside the country and maybe majority of them, you could have even taken the register where the members are you coming to vote you cannot just expect that and then they explain to you and then you are not mobilizing so minority leader you also need to up your game these guys knew that the today is voting and they came in numbers for those who are our uh, the Kenya kwanza of members who are not in the country right now they they, they uh, who are not in the country they were able to to mobilize those who are in the country and that is a fact so for us who are not, so it was like maybe you knew that we are going to, the, the, the finance is not going, we are, not, we are going to lose it. So you are doing it intentionally so that some other members could be seen as traitors because you are in the, in the, in the, powers and the leadership of power. You could have advised that other members, this is a very crucial. And then you can communicate to us and say that there are others and because of ABCD. That is the reason, but... For me, my position was that the finance bill could have been considered. I mean, Morocco, they are doing what you call the affordable housing. But this affordable housing that they are doing, you can see all these houses. This is affordable housing. But they have strategies. I'm going to share with you. These are the affordable housing that they're having. But they're not charging Kenyans. They're not, charging, they're not charging Moroccan people that they have to be a certain a compulsory. Eh, whether even a 0, 0, 0, 0, 0.00.0. There's nothing. It becomes as a grant. And they have, like, uh, the income task is not paid for those. Uh, and it's private. It's, uh, uh, it's called uh, private, uh, private government partnership whereby they're just doing uh, uh, no corporate tax to the investors. And for the investor who is there to build these houses, you can you are only allowed to benefit from the uh, value and uh, VAT uh, income tax, corporate tax, uh, income tax, when you can only build for 500 units of a house. And also you find like a, a house uh, is only, can only come in up to around um, uh, uh, a flat can be constructed by 4 million and it has uh, many units and that is uh, the kind of the conversation that we ought to have as a country and that's why we have come to learn and to have come to learn and to the benchmarking so that's why I said that members there is a lot that we need to do in the country not just to punish uh, Kenyans so we are telling there's new, lead, there's new leadership also in the in the National Assembly to up their game, to up their game, also be communicating to the members. Let us have people to communicate, where are you? We are voting today. Don't assume that everybody is on WhatsApp, that everyone is learning everything. I think there is a problem somewhere. And now you should use this thing to come and tell other members that have voted yes or no. In fact, they could have voted for a PG. 
yesterday or uh, uh, June uh, and say members, we are coming for a treaty immediately to discuss ABCD. Do we have the numbers? Do we have the numbers? Then uh, uh, let us stop playing PR to the Kenyans so that the Kenyans can see who is voting yes and who is no. So all the blame should go to the Kenya Kwanza because they have the numbers. They can decide. If the, 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 the president decides to do whatever he wants to do with this country, he will do. Unless now we Kenyans will also arise, and Kenyans who voted for Kenya Kwanza should also not blame members of the parliament for failing because they are the ones who gave them powers. Yeah. Let me go and sleep because uh, we, we are, we are, we are, let me go and sleep. Yeah, let me go and sleep.